Jerry Rose for the Thomas Picayune and NOLA.com over at St. Michael High School with Jacob Evans, who is our preseason all Baton Rouge area large schools basketball player of the year. Uh, mouthful. <laughs> but <laughs> man, what's it what's it mean to, to start the senior year and, and to be at, at that position? Because it's been kind of a, a long process for you to go from that, that freshman year coming over here to now yeah. being – you know, one of the, the top one or two probably uh, prospects in the state and, and a guy that's that's expected to be a leader over here? Well, it, it means a lot. Like, the process wasn't easy coming in my freshman year. I mean, I was I always felt like I was good, but I never, like, worked as hard as I should have. So then when I got here, I saw that my teammates, you know, my first year, we weren't that good. But I saw how hard everyone else worked, and I just feel like that just put something to me. And I saw how, how, how they took every practice serious. They took every game, every possession, everything, even the pickup, shooting drills, everything was serious, game speed. And I feel like I just had to do it too. And then once I started seeing some success from it, you know, my jump shot started coming along, then ball handling, then I was like, man, I'm just going to put in even more work. So I started working harder, even harder, harder, harder. Then I got the opportunity this summer to play against some of the elite competition in the nation I, to compare myself. You know, I was kind of nervous going in, but then I was, had success, and I was like, man, I could play. I feel like I'm better than most of them. So I was like, I'm just going to keep working hard and see where, how far that takes me. Senior season is just starting, and I know Coach Hart said when you came back from summer that your consistency from deep was, was something that he wasn't expecting that big of a stride coming back over the summer. How much different or uh, you know, more well-rounded do you expect your game to look like your senior year of high school than it even was as a junior or early in the summer? Well, I feel like my percentage from three has just gotten this is way better now. I also, I watch film a lot on myself and the team. I see what we can work on, and I saw that I need to crash the offensive boards more. I was like, sometimes I just stand around half court looking and waiting to get back on defense where I could just go get an offensive rebound and get a bucket. So that's another thing I took as a personal challenge for me is to grab more rebounds, offense and defensive end play up tight on defense and get and just staying out of foul trouble because this year we're not really that deep. And I just feel like my all-around game this year is just going to be phenomenal because I, my, my teammates, they believe in me, I believe in them, probably even like way more than what they think. But I just feel like if they're open, I pass the ball, he's going to make it. That's how much confidence I have in him. Yeah. Um, you might have hit on it some there, but in terms of senior year goals and stuff like that, um, maybe beyond just – showing that well-rounded game and, and working hard, rebounds and all that. What are some of the things y'all are talking about trying to accomplish this year as it gets going? Well, first off, we, I know we all, always wanted to get a district championship. We haven't had a district championship, I don't think, ever in the school history. But I feel like this year we can really get it. We're hungry for it. I just see it in everyone's eyes. Also, we got to the second round of the playoff last year, lost to STM. And most of us after the game were looking like, man, we really could have won that game. And that was like the first experience that we had, like, at, in, that, in that type of game. So it's like this year we even like we wanted more, we're thriving for it, we're hungry for it. I see it in everyone's eyes that we just that we're just gonna go much farther than we were last year, even though we were a really good team last year too. Do you have any early sense of with the progress you've made and, and kind of climbing some of those recruiting rankings and now being preseason player of the year and um, and going in Cincinnati signee as of today, um, is that is that gonna be a whole different challenge in terms of what folks are, are throwing at you um, and having, everyone always says having that target or bullseye or whatever. Yeah. Do, you, do you have any sense of that, of, of if that's going to be a little bit different of a challenge? Yeah, I feel like it's going to be a, a, I feel like people are going to like be out to like get me, go at me in the games. And I feel like, I, I actually, I like it. Like, I feel like it's a blessing because it shows how hard I work to get where I am. But also, it just lets me know that game in, game out, every night, that I'm going to have to play my hardest because there's going to be someone else on the other team or the whole other team trying to stop me or trying to go at me on the court. And I just won't let it happen. I'm going in in every game this year, trying to get a win, playing hard as I can every possession. And I feel like that bullseye is just something to motivate me every game, every practice. There you go. Jacob Evans, our all Baton Rouge area, large schools preseason player of the year over at St. Michael uh, and for NOLA.com and Thomas McCune, Jared Roser.